I'm not the one who's so... Good morning, Broadhead High School. Today is Thursday, October 1st, 2015, and here are your morning announcements. Ashley Olson Senior Project, the Literary Club, will be every Friday for the rest of the year during resource in Mrs. Hurt's room. Attention seniors, the scholarship list has been updated. Please pick up a copy in the guidance office. If you would like the chance to be able to work with younger kids this year, Big Brothers Big Sisters applications are now available in the high school office. The program takes place every Tuesday from 3.15 to 4 and will begin October 27th the end of February to the end of February 16th. Applications are due October 9th to the high school office. Note, if you are a returning member of the program, you, need to, you do need to turn in a teacher recommendation with your application. Attention students who are traveling to Puerto Rico. There will be a fundraiser meeting in Ms. Lawrence's room during resource on Thursday the 8th. If you are interested in earning some money for your trip, make sure to attend the short meeting. Gracias, amigos. There will be an ASA meeting on Friday, October 2nd in the art room during resource time. ASA stands for Association of Student Artists. You do not need to have, you do not have to be in an art class to be part of this group. Just an interest in art is all you need to attend the meeting. Come this Friday to hear what ASA is all about. Seniors and juniors, please check your school email for emails from Mrs. Flory. This is how you will learn about scholarships, college rep visits, campus preview days, testing deadlines, etc. You should be checking your school email at least twice a week. If you prefer to use a different email address or have your parents include on the group list, please see Mrs. Flory. My favorite band is Queen. My favorite rock band would probably be like I'd have to say either rock or maybe School. This is your Broadhead Media Sports Shorts. SMU, the basketball team, um, they're now postseason ineligible due to academic fraud. And tonight, football, the Pittsburgh Steelers are playing the Baltimore Ravens, the first game for Pittsburgh without Ben Roethlisberger. Charles Woodson, the former Green Bay Packer, became the second player in history to have at least one interception in 18 straight seasons. There is a pink out. At the volleyball game tonight against Bigfoot, they have a chance to tie for conference. Be there or be square. So far this year in media, I think our group is doing a great job. There is a common misconception that uh, you will die if you take this class. That might be true if we haven't had enough coffee, but um, once you get into it, it's actually not as much work as you think it is. And it's fun, it doesn't feel like work. You can sit here and edit videos all day and not realize that you've been in here doing stuff. So um, I'm excited about the things that we're doing this year with the new announcement themes, the beats. Um, I'm excited to see our first official project this Friday. And I encourage you all to join next semester because it is just great fun. What I think of me is so far is that it's a really good class, gives you time to work on computers, gives us time to do um, announcements for the entire school. It's basically an amazing class, you get to do many things that you want to do if you want to do And I'll be going on the 20th. Uh, my thoughts about media is it's a fun class. Mrs. Biber is pretty demanding of what we ask, of what she asks of us, but I really enjoy the class and I really enjoy the people. Oh, my! <laughs> uh, this year's media class has been awesome. We have a small class, but they have been working just fantastically and working really hard. They've learned a lot about the uh, computers, the Mac computers, and the operating system, and the editor, which is Final Cut Pro, and becoming excellent editors. Okay, today for lunch, it's a cheese you're gonna whole grain bun, melon and fruit cocktail, green bean and asparagus, your choice of milk, a la carte taco bar. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but it's on here, so there you go. All right, today's weather is a high of 61 and a low of 42. 